Hi folks, this is an update for my previous TDA7492P video. I was playing around with this module because I want to make a portable case for it and guess what? I just blow it up. So I'm about to use this... What is this? <laughs> <laughs> so I'm about to use this cordless lithium ion battery. So the idea is that I 3D printed this snap-on connector for the lithium ion battery and I will connect the module to this and the small case will be built just for this you can imagine that but for the time being I'm using this very fast and ugly solution here this is just a piece of pipe cut and uh, the wires just connected to here so I can snap it onto the battery and yes I've made a mistake where I just missed the polarity so I connected it the other way around the funny thing was that the switch was not even turned on at this point so let's try it again. Here we have the battery with the wrong polarity on. Here we have the module. Safety goggles on. And let's see some magic, magic smoke. Yes. <laughs> I believe that's enough for now. So what we saw now is that this and this IC was escaped smoke so the really interesting thing is that how it is possible that when the switch is not turned on something was went wrong in the circuit so i switch back the polarity and i will plug the plug in and turn it on this time the right polarity you can see that the power led slides on and what you can see is that the bluetooth module still survived this impact so the bluetooth module is working and you can see that it is connected to the Bluetooth, so at least the Bluetooth module was survived. So that's all for now. I hope you liked it. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.